Happy May the 4th! Woo! It's Star Wars Day! I am so excited. <laughs> I'm even wearing my students I am your teacher shirt. <laughs> but um, anyway, I just wanted to give you a quick update. We are in week seven of this whole social distancing and um, school dismissal thing. So um, I know that it's been trying and maybe even frustrating at points, um, especially for parents and students. Um, but I, I can tell you that I shared in those feelings as well because I am a mom too. Um, but I wanted to give you a little bit of an update as to what is happening this week and in the weeks to come. Okay, so here we go. Let's get to it. All right, so literacy class, in fact, the whole school will be joining in on reading Charlotte's Web. Charlotte's Web was one of my favorite books growing up and definitely one of my favorite movies. <laughs> and um, I really enjoyed it. And I know that my kids are going to enjoy it too. Um, my daughter's finally old enough where I think that the story will mean more to her. So I'm excited that this book was chosen. Um, and I think you guys will like it too if you haven't read it already. All right, so let's talk about how that's going to look. Soon, not yet, but soon on my website, there will be a link to a school website dedicated entirely to Charlotte's Web and the lessons you're going to be learning there. It will have a ton of information, and in fact, I think I have a paper with that information. Give me just one second and I'll find it. Okay, I got it. Here it is. Um, and basically, what you'll have is a reading schedule, daily vocabulary, and weekly activities. So on the website, there will be a reading schedule, and in fact, there will be videos of the teachers reading chapters of the book for you in case your mom or dad um, can't get to it that day or whatever, so you're not left in the dark. Of course, we want you to read it as a family. This is a really awesome opportunity to read together, which is awesome. So anyway, I know I say awesome a lot. It's awesome. <laughs> okay, so the reading schedule isn't too um, harsh. It's one to two chapters a day. Um, and the vocabulary, I'm so excited about. Um, vocabulary is a really cool learning opportunity because you get to talk about what a word means, how to use it in context, and all of those things. And it opens up a lot of discussions. Um, my family and I, we like to discuss vocabulary. I know this is weird, but we like to discuss vocabulary around the dinner table um, while we're eating. Like my kids will be like, what does this word mean? And then we'll talk about it. And, and they get to be exposed to new words and new meanings. And then I hear them using that, that word in their own speech, which is super cool. So make sure that you do those vocabulary words, all right? Um, and also there's gonna be weekly activities. Now the weekly activities um, you'll do with your family and you'll take a picture and you'll post it on either the website or email it to me or Miss Giles or Miss Petroff and we'll all work together to get those um, all turned in. Of course, we'd like you to stick with your literacy teacher, but do what you need to do, okay? Um, and so what we'll do, remember, there's no work going home, uh, and there's no work that needs to be turned in. This is really an on your honor. We want you to be accountable still, which is why we're asking you to take pictures and submit them to the website or to us, all right? So real quick recap. Literacy, you're reading Charlotte's Web. You will be doing vocabulary, reading the book, and weekly activities, all to be posted on a website that will be available beginning today, I believe. But if it's not there, beginning tomorrow, I will link to it on my website, and it will also be available on scholarcharter.org. Okay, math class, we're on to you now. So math is a little bit different. They've asked us to do a little bit of review, but guess what? That's what we've been doing for the past five weeks because we finished our second grade book right as this whole thing started. So, in our case, I spoke to Mr. Hall and got the okay to do um, math tasks. And I know you guys like math tasks. I know sometimes they frustrate you because they're difficult, and um, sometimes you get the wrong answer, but that's okay, all right? Um, the reason we love the tasks is because it gave us a real world um, opportunity to solve, so solve math problems, which is super cool, right? So today's math task, will be a May the 4th one, of course. And so there's a video to go along with it and that whole shebang. So make sure you get onto Canvas. There is a live course for you starting today. So get on there. You will have three tasks this week and you will have extra math as well. Keep doing extra math. We've got to build that fluency. I don't feel like we are quite ready for third grade math in our fluency area. 
So make sure that you are working hard on that and continue working on it through the summer. I know that's not what you want to hear, but please do, okay? Okay, so the tasks. Today's task, like I said, May the 4th. Then you have one Wednesday and Thursday. I'm giving you Tuesday and Friday off or to catch up, okay? Um, so Wednesday, you'll have a three-act task, and Thursday, you'll have a three-act task. Wednesday, I'm going to work through it with you just a little bit more, give you a little bit more hand-holding and help you kind of work through things. And then on Thursday, I'm not going to give you hardly any help at all, okay? So make sure that you work through them. Now, is it okay to struggle? Yes. Is it okay to think it's hard? Yes. Is it okay to give up? No. Do not give up. If you need extra help, I'm sure a parent or an older sibling would be more than willing to work with you, but do not let them give you the answer, okay? If you need help um, and you can't get help from someone else, please ask, please ask me. You can have your mom and dad email me. I'm available to Zoom call you anytime, okay? That's my job and I want to help you. I know I had fun with another student last week who needed help with their rounding walk. So guess what? I got on Zoom with my cell phone and I walked down my neighborhood and we did our rounding talk together. So I am available for you. That's what I'm here for, okay? All right, guys, quick recap for math. You are going to be working in Canvas this week. The module is live already. You are doing three tasks and extra math every single day, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, okay? All right, guys, that is it for me. I did put up a new joke on the website, so I hope you like that one. Um, I miss you guys. You are so smart, and you're so talented, and I just wish that we were Star Warsing it up together today. Um, you guys are awesome. I miss you. Bye.